I just rewatched a few episodes of the TV show Friends, which went up on Netflix in its entirety. And it was a delightfully nostalgic experience. There's so much about the show that feels so dated now. There's people wearing hair scrunchies. There's Rachel's overalls. The fact that no one has cell phones. Um, but one aspect that really jumped out at me was the character Ross, who is uh, he's the nerd. Like, this is one of his three defining character traits, along with being whiny and pretentious, I guess. Um, the way that that character trait is communicated to the audience is that every episode or two, Ross will start rattling off some random science fact, like, you know, back in the Mesozoic era. And then his friends will all, like, instantly ugh, pretend to fall asleep because, uh, you know, science is boring and Ross is so nerdy. And the fact that this felt so uh, dated to me made me realize just how differently society views nerds than it did a mere 15 years ago. You know, portrayals of nerds now are at worst neutral, basically, and at best, like, admiring. Um, and I think there's a bunch of reasons for this, but probably one of them is the fact that the kids who grew up nerdy in the 80s and 90s are now, like, making it big in Silicon Valley and not just incredibly rich, but actually setting the standard for what counts as cool nowadays. Um, you wouldn't see things like I Fucking Love Science, uh, the Facebook group, having as many millions and millions of subscribers as it does if being nerdy were not, in fact, now cool. And what I finally realized was the one thing above all other things that really proves that our like societal perception of nerds have changed is what I call the nerd humble brag. So this is when someone says like, you know guys, oh, I'm so tired. I like stayed up all last night. I couldn't put down the latest Malcolm Gladwell book. God, I know I'm such a nerd. It's so bad. <laughs> um, typically in these cases, the thing that the person is saying makes them a nerd is not really what I would call nerdy. Like it's not particularly, um, intellectual or, or sciencey or analytical. Um, but the important point is that they want to be seen as a nerd. And you can't explicitly brag, so they have to disguise their boast as self-deprecation, which is why they'll say like, oh god, it's so embarrassing, I'm such a nerd. Um, this is really, I think, how we can tell that the nerds have finally won the culture wars.